All right, Merry Christmas, everyone. This is uh, Tesla Family Travels. Thank you for joining us. Uh, Tesla just released the holiday update today. We're really excited, and uh, uh, I brought my wife, Joanna, here. She's holding the camera. Say hi, Joanna. Hello. Hi, we're going to be going through the uh, release notes. I've seen a few things online, so we're excited to kind of try this out ourselves and, and go through it. But uh, this is the screen. This is the uh, 2020.48. This is .25, but it's actually .26. I think that actually might be a, a typo on the on the screen here. But these are the – this is the new view. You can see here that the car has a different animation on it. I noticed that if you roll the window up you can actually see the window animation going up which is really cool and the same thing going down and then I also noticed that when you open the door it actually gives you that nice little smooth animation so it's super cool there check that out uh, anyway I haven't gone through this yet so we're gonna go through this together and kind of go through here I have read online that uh, there are a few new games and I think that's what we're seeing here this first one here says the battle of polytopia so don't know what game that is but we'll have to try that out uh, we also have Cat Quest here. I'm um, not sure what that is, but I'm sure the cats are going to make everybody excited, especially here on YouTube. And then uh, the old classic Solitaire. So that one looks like uh, that could be fun as well. This is the one I'm hearing everybody talk about. It's Boombox. It says, uh, turn your car into a boombox and entertain a crowd with your media player when parked. You can also customize the sound of your car makes when you press the horn, drive the car, or when your car is moving with some, and select an option for the drop-down menu or insert your own USB device and save up to five custom sounds. I have a feeling that this is going to be a $45,000 toy for me here, so I'm really excited to try this boombox feature, but we'll try that out. Uh, driving visualization improvements. I think we can already see a lot of that right here with the new animation on the car. Really sweet, really cool. Doesn't look like you can swipe it around, but we'll have to play around with that a little bit later. But it looks like they changed the layout on a few things here. I've noticed a few things different already. It looks like they've changed the color of the battery here. They've moved the drive uh, selector onto the left-hand side here, and they've also moved the, uh, the uh, headlights uh, light on the, on the side here as well scheduled departure improvements uh, so it looks now like you can precondition the battery and in the cabin even when the car is not plugged in so that's really cool and then this is one of the things that I'm really excited about it says to account for different utility rate plans you can now set a time when you can schedule your off-peak rates for us here we live in a city called Canyon Lake we don't have any uh, any uh, gas here in the city so everything in in this town is 100% electric so our electric bill is already very very expensive so our electric rates uh, go down at 9 p.m. and it's always been a little bit of a hassle to get the car to start charging at 9 p.m. so it looks like uh, there's some new improvements here to the uh, charging and departure time so we'll have to check that out emissions testing mode of course everybody knows that that's the fart mode my wife seems to enjoy that one the most mm -hmm. uh, and it looks like this can be now used outside the car so we'll have to play around with that supercharger display improvement so uh, I was reading a little bit on this it says that the uh, number that you see here on the supercharger is going to tell you how many open stalls are available so that's really cool it looks like you'll be able to go through that so we'll check out some things on the map there and then vehicle information it looks like they've removed the Tesla T and they've put the uh, same information underneath the controls and then software so let's kind of go through the bottom here let's see what we've got looks like we have a new uh, screen view on the bottom some of the things do look the same but let's get right into it let's go right into the toy box here and then let's get into the boom box I think everybody's gonna be excited about this one uh, so this one is where you can actually go through and play around with some of the different sounds right now if you honk the horn it's just the regular horn sound but I was looking at what people are doing here it actually looks now what you can do is replace the horn you can actually fart <laughs> outside of the car now. That's let's awesome. Try, let's try that again. <laughs> Wait, our neighbors are going to hate us in a little bit here. Let's see what other sounds they have here. We have posh. I don't know what these are. Let's go through them together. Well, I never. <laughs> oh, Sounds like almost like a little Stewie Griffin type of voice there. Let's try it again. Well, I never. Well, I never. All right, so that's exciting. Let's try this one. Toss a coin. I don't know what that is. It must be a song. Do you, hmm. Is that a song? Have you heard of that? No. Yeah, all right. That one, that one's, eh, we'll see. Let's try goat. <laughs> <laughs> the goat's exciting. I like that one. Old, Old horn. horn. Oh, an aruga oh, horn. I like that. An aruga horn. Let's try that one again. 
Uh, I think I might be using that one. Let's see what else we got. Applause. All right, I think that one's self-explanatory there. Applause. Uh, Ta-da. I think we know what this one's going to sound like. <laughs> really funny. Let's see what else we got here. Uh, this looks like a rim shot. Yep, rim shot right there. All right, I like that one. DJ. Oh, it's that would the DJ. be something I use. It's the DJ horn. Any Kevin and Bean fans out there will recognize that. That's Omar Khan's uh, DJ horn. All right, let's see what else we got here. All right, La Cucaracha. Oh, please. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. Well, Joanna, I think you know which one I'm going to be using the most here. I mean, if you definitely want to get noticed, for sure, the cucaracha. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. All right, so that's the horn sounds. By the way, that's Seth in the back there. He's uh, sitting in the car with us. He's uh, uh, entertained with his bottle. But let's go through some of these other sounds that we have here. Let's go through the driving sounds. Coconuts. Might be a little hard to hear. That sounds like it might be like some uh, horses, maybe, Joanna? Some horses walking? Hmm. Let's see what else we got here. You have to push stop. Oh, stop. All right, there we go. Uh, Polynesian elevator music. Mm, this might be hard to hear. There you go. Okay, all right. Let's go back. Let's go back to the first one here and try that one again. What is this? This looks like a... Oh, wait. Let's hear coconut. Okay. All right. Coconuts. This looks like a snake and a saxophone. Oh, a snake charmer. Kind of like creeping up. I guess if you're driving the car, it kind of sounds like you're creeping up. Let's see what else we got here. Let's go back to that Polynesian elevator music. Let's see what else we got here. Back to toss a coin. Check out what else we got here. Rainforest. Oh, this sounds like the Rainforest Cafe. Uh-huh. Alright. Kind of peaceful. Let's see what else we got here. Rock and roll. Whoa, that was kind of loud. Yeah. Rock and roll music. Let's see what else we got here. Harp. A little peaceful. I think this would fit a uh, white Tesla better than the black one. You know? no. I think the black Tesla's got to go with the rock. This just sounds roll. annoying. <laughs> Let's see. Ice cream. Oh, we can fool the little kids on the street as we're driving through. No. We can make it sound like we're an ice cream truck. Let's see what else we got. Merry-go-round. We got two more here. Very interesting. How's it going? Let's see what else we got here. We got Caribbean sound. Neighbor just walked out. He probably thinks we're weird. That's fair. So it looks like these are all the sounds that play when the car is driving. So it looks like you have some options there. And then summon, when you send the car out for summon, it looks like it's the same uh, options there as well. So we'll have to play around a little bit with those more later. But this is the uh, boom box under the toy box section. So it uh, looks like something definitely fun for uh, uh, the Tesla owners out there. 
doesn't look like this has changed any this looks like this is still the emissions mode it does look like you have the outdoor option here so we kind of heard the fart earlier uh, tracks was updated uh, a little bit earlier I told uh, my wife Joanna that I had kind of made a custom uh, track earlier so let's just play it here and let's see what it sounds like let's see if the uh, with the update if it's uh, changed any differently but let's check it out oh you can see my reflection in the mm, Hello. <laughs> so let's see here looks like we've oh here's the one that I made let's see here how do we play oh that's it it's not there well it looks like when you update the uh, the car it looks like you may have lost anything that you've created which kind of stinks but that's okay we'll go through it another time uh, let's exit out of here let's see if there's been any updates to the uh, entertainment section because we are parked here it looks like it's still the same uh, video and theater options available here Netflix Hulu uh, YouTube uh, and then Twitch and of course the Tesla tutorials are still there as well we had heard that there was a rumor that Disney Plus is gonna make an appearance but it doesn't look like it's uh, it's been added yet let's check out the arcade so it looks like they have added a few of the games here here's that polytopia that we saw looks like you'll be able to play this online that's different that's something that we haven't seen before in any of these Tesla games uh, let's check out what else we have here. We have a uh, solitaire, uh, just one player there. It's touch screen. Uh, Cat Quest, uh, one player. We don't have a controller. We're going to have to purchase a controller, and then once we get a controller, uh, we'll be able to play some of these other games. Right now, we're kind of limited on the games that we can play. Uh, Fallout Shelter, these look like these are existing games that have been there uh, for some time. So, very cool though. Definitely a couple added games. We'll have to play around with those uh, later as well. And then let's see here, let's cancel this. Um, let's kind of go through some of the menus here, see if, if anything's changed. Looks like Spotify is still the same. Looks like we uh, click on the streaming. Looks like this all remains the same. At least today, radio. Looks like the radio hasn't changed any. So it looks like they've kept all the media stuff the same. Not much changes there. This is different. This uh, little uh, windshield wiper icon wasn't there before. I think it was located up here before. Maybe I'm incorrect, but I don't recall seeing that before. Uh, we had also heard that there was going to be some changes on the camera that gives you an over, overhead view. Uh, Elon had tweeted that out. Doesn't look like that's in this update. So we'll have to uh, kind of wait and see what happens with that. Bring that back down here. Looks like the seat heaters are still the same. Overall, it looks like it's still the same features, just a nice polished up version of this car. So a uh, really, really nice update, really looks uh, uh, very clean. I think they're getting ready for that new full self-driving uh, version of this software. So definitely some fun things in this new update. Uh, we'll have to play around with it. I think uh, Joanna and I, I promised Joanna that we'd go get some coffee right now. So we're gonna take the car out for a quick trip uh, to get some coffee. Uh, we'll try out some of the full self-driving features, see if anything's uh, been added. Added. I know it's still in beta. I am not one of the beta testers. I did uh, purchase the full self-driving software when we uh, bought the car. Um, so uh, we'll give it a shot when we go out to the uh, coffee here. If anything's different, we'll let you guys know. But anyway, thank you for joining. Thank you for watching. Uh, that boom box is definitely something fun and exciting and something that I think uh, Tesla owners are going to get a kick out of. So uh, we appreciate you watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. We're trying to get this channel over a thousand. I think we're an 800 version of uh, 800 uh, number right now so please help us get over a thousand your subscription would be uh, much appreciated so thank you very much and we'll talk to everyone later thank you bye-bye so quick update for everyone we did uh, take a quick trip over here to the Starbucks and I wanted to share this screen it looks like there's still some bugs to be worked out uh, I was just going through looking at some of the menus in fact I had hit the sh uh, charging button in particular let's get that centered there and uh, looks like uh, this thing is all jammed up and I can't do anything with it. So um, I just wanted to point out that even though the Christmas update is out, looks like they might have rushed it out a little bit. Looks like there are some bugs to work out. So I'm gonna do a soft reboot here while we're waiting in line for coffee and uh, uh, maybe back with another update. We'll see, so uh, stay tuned.